LeBron James, LeBron James, LeBron James, and LeLon James. These four nations were the ones that protected the world, but then LeBron James ended up advancing and attacking. And when the world needed the Avatar most, he vanished. Then a hundred years later, me and my brother ended up finding the new Avatar, Leong James. And although he may be a court equer, maybe he can bring peace to this world. <laughs> Welcome back, everybody. I hope y'all have been enjoying the Let's Play. If you have, make sure you hit the like, subscribe, hit the notification bells for more. Yes, I have been watching Avatar 2. Really good show. Really, really good show. I think I talked about it before that I was going to watch Avatar and then watch Legends of Korra afterwards. Why is there another chance? I also met Welmer last time, not freaking Whale Lord. Um... Yeah, I, I, I haven't got back into um, Avatar, mainly because I've been, like, really busy. But, goodness, hiccups again. See? Hiccups every, every time I start recording. It's, it's not before. It's, it's always endearing. Um, I do plan on getting back into it. I just need to get more time to get back into it. A lot of recording, a lot of, lot of stuff. But thanks for jump kicking the, you know, like, 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 like the bug and flying. I think Beautiful's bug and flying. Are the bug and, bug and flying or bug and grass once it... We're, oh, it has a really high physical. I mean, special. That was stupid of me. Why is there so many chances? Oh, yeah, beautiful eyes. Freaking accuracy is only 60%. <sighs> oh, you have grudge. Oh, we're going to lose. Oh, I'm going to go all, I'm, I'm to go all the way back to the freaking H center thing of Majiggy. Um, the H center, the Pokemon center. Oracle's head it looks like it's wearing a headband. I don't dislike it. I just find it really funny. The ninja twerker. The ninja twerker. This ninja will hit you with the um 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 earth style twerk wall jutsu. Oh, bro, my freaking powerpoints. Oh my god, this is why I hate, I hate grudge. This is why I tell people to never hold a grudge because if you hold a grudge when your opponent takes you down. They're gonna take all your power. You're gonna take all their power. Like, like I, I messed that all up. I meant to say, don't ever mess with anyone who holds a grudge against you because once you take them down, they're gonna take away all your power. Yeah, see? See? Look at that, see? You learn stuff when you come to this Let's Play. You learn stuff. You learn about, um, like, you learn about the new Avatar, Long James. Long James is a really good art. Right, Avatar 2. Um. Wow, Horn Attack is actually really powerful. Um. Oh, oh, never mind, Dragon. Oh, never mind, Dragon Breath is 95% accuracy. Um, I don't think it's actually worth it. Nah, it, it's well, it is two stages, but nah, nah, it's fine. I, 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 oh, whoops, I forgot this. Oops, that's wrong. Yeah, this is gonna be like a um, like who's the bro? Who's bro and sis? Who's the bro? Uh, uh, okay, I'm gonna guess though. Okay, well, the other one's Am. Uh, I don't... I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Y'all guess who the bro is down below. I I, I have no clue to be honest. <laughs> um, I just blanked out what I was saying before this. Oh, yeah, by the way, uh, when the YouTube channel hits 5K, I'm going to be doing a giveaway. So, yeah, make sure you are commenting on a lot of posts because the person who comments the most is going to get the number one prize, which would be $50. Uh, probably, probably like a $50 Amazon card. Uh, second prize will be like 20 20 and then third prize, I haven't decided yet. I, I don't know. Maybe you'll get a freaking potato. Yeah, I'll probably send somebody a potato. Um, this is going to be like a grinding episode, if y'all haven't noticed, by the way, mainly because we cannot beat uh, watching yet. So, yeah, we're just going to be grinding and talking about random stuff like Pokemon Scarlet and Violet trailers came out by the time this episode goes up. Um, looks OK. Looks OK. I, I bro, bro, why you got to have a Reggie rock? Oh my god. Go get a life. By the way, 420, I'm not sure if I'm really keeping it now because it has a really bad moveset too, just like Beautiful Light. The Pokemon on my team have really bad movesets, so I'm really mad about that. But uh, Scarlet and Violet, they look okay, you know, they don't look that bad. Um, I like the newer Pokemon more than I did like Sword and Shield's newer Pokemon. That's not really saying much because I've been very outspoken on Sword and Shield having really bad uh, Pokemon design, so yeah. Um, 
the small live i think it is i think that's the name of it small live looks pretty cool i'm hoping maybe it'll evolve into like a really i don't know what they're gonna do with that because it's, it's an olive it's an olive pokemon so i have no clue what they're gonna do with that um maybe they'll do some weird plant type thing i don't maybe it'll like it'll evolve into the can of olives I don't, I, I don't know. Maybe it'll, maybe it'll be like the eggs. Maybe it'll be like eggs execute and have like a bunch of olives. Ah, uh, of course you have poison point. Yeah, I don't, I don't know what they're gonna do with small live, but that's a really odd one. Um, Lechunk, I do like that one, Lechunk James. <laughs> that's the nickname I'm giving it now. So yeah, I, I, I do like that one. Um, it's very chunky. I like my little chunky chunk. Um, I really hate when it does this. I that's why I'm so glad poisoning effects don't happen like this anymore. Um, wasn't it little chunk like a? It's a pig, right? It'll probably be something like um. I'm assuming it's gonna get like a Granbull esque kind of uh, evolution thing where it's gonna probably go on to two feet. I don't see it staying on four feet the entire time. It looks pretty cool though. I gotta say I don't mind that one as much. Um, it actually looks pretty cool, so I, I'm, I'm very, I would be very shocked if it didn't get a really cool evolution. Like, if I had to pick one out of all the new things we got, that's the one, like, besides, like, the starters, because I think, like, I, I'm hoping at least, like, one of the starters will get, like, a good thing. But, um, out of all of them, though, like, out of all the new Pokemon we got... I'm assuming that one's gonna look good. Like it's, it's it, there. There's no way it just looks bad. Um, Palmy? I I think Palmy is how you pronounce that. Um, it's going. It's gonna be like the Pikachu. It's gonna be like the Pikachu of the of of this region. So it may not get an evolution. You know what? Now that I think about it, Small Live is grass and normal. I, I'm looking at the Pokemon thing on um uh, on uh, Instagram. It's grass and normal with the ability early bird. I think most of the time it's usually flying types that have that ability. So I'm assuming that small it will likely go from a grass and normal to a grass and flying. I don't like the combination of grass and normal, by the way. It's kind of boring to me. Um, I feel like it could have been a bit better, but whatever. I'm not going to hate on it too much. What was LeChunk again? LeChunk is a normal type. Okay, LeChunk's a normal type. I'm assuming that it'll probably be a normal and ground type when it's all said and done. It kind of has like that ground. It has like that gray and brown, so I'm assuming it's gonna get a ground typing, maybe a steel typing afterwards. Um, this train is really freaking annoying, and I forgot to close my windows because it's, it's like super freaking hot. So I didn't want to close my windows. Hopefully, y'all can't hear it in the background. Y'all probably sh you shouldn't be able to. Um, probably can. Okay. I was trying to think of what type Relicanth was. Relicanth is always a Pokemon I felt like that should have got like an evolution. Like just something. It also should have been a lot more um, prominent in the Pokemon games. Cause like, don't you need a Relicanth to go get one of the Reggies? Like why is it? Well, then again, I guess you need Whelm or two though. Do you need Relicanth? I might just think you need Relicanth. I think I might just, I think I might just be thinking you need Relicanth. Relicanth has always been one of the random Pokemon to me. Like it's just, it's, it's just kind of there, you know. It's not like good. It's not like bad. It's just kind of, kind of alright. Um. Yeah, and then the starters, they they're, they're gonna be the starters. I will say the legendaries look a bit better than Sword and Shield. Um, it's not like a major increase. Um, they look cool. I'll put all these on the screen, by the way, so don't worry. Um. The one, what the heck is that thing's name? Corridon, I think that's how you pronounce it. Uh, yeah, I'm assuming Cor Corridon. Um, it looks like it has a tire on its chest. I don't, I don't know what the, heck the point of that is. Um, so yeah, Miradon looks pretty sick. I like the purple design on it. I like just like the overall look of it. I think um, the color scheme looks really, really nice. Um, I like that it, one, I like the fact that it, I like the fact that it doesn't look like it has a freaking tire on his chest. And two, I just like the overall, I'm getting electric and dragon, or electric and poison from this one. Um, I'm leaning more towards dragon though, I feel like both of these are going to be dragon typings. Um, 
I'm assuming Corridon will be a dragon and fire. But maybe not, though. Maybe if we get new typings, it might just be a whole new typing. Um, but I'm assuming if I had to pick right now for Corridon, I would likely pick either Dragon and Fire or Dragon and Fighting. For Mirrodon, either Poison and Dragon or Psychic and Dragon. Or possibly Electric and Dragon. Oh, okay, <laughs> that was a lot of... Okay. For Mirrodon, either A, Dragon and Poison, Dragon and Poison, Dragon... It's gonna be either Dragon and Poison, Dragon and Electric, or Dragon and Psychic, or it's gonna be Psychic and Electric or Poison and Electric. I'm assuming something dual typing for sure. The Poison... I'm not so sold on the Poison. I'm more sold on, like, the Psychic and maybe Dragon. I think that's a pretty cool combination. Have we got Dragon and Electric? Yeah, we got Dragon and Electric with Gen 5. Okay, so I'm gonna lean more towards Electric and Psychic. I'm gonna go Electric and Psychic. I don't know if we've gotten Electric Psychic Pokemon. Um, I could be completely wrong on that, and we actually have, but I'm gonna go to Electric and, Dra electric and Psychic. I just literally, look at that, that quick, I, I can forget what the heck I said. Um, and then, what the heck was the freaking thing's name? I literally just blanked on it right now. Uh, Corridon, I'm gonna go with Dragon and Fighting. I don't feel so... See, that's the thing. If... Well, Dragon and Fighting, Psychic and... Okay, thanks for the random subscription or follow somebody. I don't I don't know. It, it didn't pop up on my screen, though. Why am I looking on one screen when I have everything on the other screen? Um... Uh... Dragon and Fighting. I feel like that makes a good combination, Dragon and Fighting. Oh, you know what? Maybe Fairy and... Nah, I feel like it won't be Fairy. Oh, uh, Fairy's not a bad combination. Oh, whoops, I forgot about that. Uh, uh, put that one over there, and then put Leaf Blade onto the Azumarill. Um, yeah, I was trying to think of maybe, like, something that could cancel each other out, so if, like, one's Dragon and Fighting, the other one could be, like, Fairy and Electric or Fairy and something like that, because like Fairy would work against the fighting part of it. But nah, never mind. So I'll go Dragon and Fighting, Psychic and Electric for the typing. So th those are my final choices. So my final choices, but I will say I could be completely off. Now I will say too, if they get like a new type, if, if there's like new typings that get brought into the game, I, I couldn't have guessed that. I am assuming the sound typing will be added. I am definitely seeing sound typing getting added um, I'm gonna get rid of poison gas. I don't know when. But what? Wait, not, not. I don't know when. I don't know who is gonna get. I don't know if it's gonna be like a new Pokemon or old Pokemon. Um, the sound typing will definitely get added though. If it is old Pokemon, if they bring the Wishmer line, it's 100% getting the sound typing. If it doesn't get the sound typing, I would be astonished. Like, that would be one of the craziest things to happen because it's literally the sound-based Pokemon. Um. Who else would get it? There's another Pokemon that has a sound theme to them. Uh, Chatot. Chatot might actually get an evolution too, to be honest, in this game. I could definitely see that happening. Um, I know there's another sound-based Pokemon. Not Toxicity, Toxtricity, because that's like really, really new. If it got its type changed, that would be insane. And it's already like Electric and Poison too, so that just wouldn't even make sense. Not nah, screw you. Um... Chatot, the Wishmer line. I would have said no, not lightning. That would be weird. I mean, yeah, I already got evolution and everything. Oh, screw you. Um, I don't know who else could get it. I don't know. Um, mm, nope, nope. Can't think of anybody else. Oh, of course you have drop back. Okay, thank you. That's you didn't think. So that's good. Um, let's swap out. I'm wondering if Torkoal would get an evolution. I don't think it would. I think that wouldn't make any sense, to be honest. Um, there's a possibility it could, though. But I feel like Torkoal is one of those Pokemon. Oh, Torkoal, Torkoal, not Torkoal. I I'm gonna always call Torkoal. Tor blah, 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 blah. I'm always going to call Torkoal, Torkoal, because of this damn Let's Play. Um, what does it wrap me with? 
to wrap me with his big old fins. See, look at this. Big fins on a big Pokemon. On a big Pokemon. Why did the other one have, why, why did Wailmer have little fins? Doesn't make any sense. I'm really hoping you get another good move. Dang it, didn't learn anything. Um, what was I saying? What, what Pokemon was I talking about again? Oh, Torkoal. Um, yeah, I don't see Torkoal getting an evolution, but I would not be the most surprised. I definitely do see us getting some new evolutions, though. Chatot, if it does get the sound typing, I'm almost 100% positive it will get a new evolution. If it's even in the game, I'm, I'm, I'm almost... If it's in the game, but there's no new sound typing, I'm 70% positive it'll get a new evolution. If it is in the game, and there's a sound typing, I'm 100% positive it will get an evolution. If I'm wrong... I would be super surprised. Like I would be, I would be, I would be honestly concerned because I would be like, "What the heck could have got an evolution?" Now, granted, there have been some really odd choices for evolutions. I'm gonna put, um, yeah, we'll keep Beautifly up front for, an, uh, yeah, because I could just go level up Raphael real quick after this. We don't have cuts. That sucks. But there's. That's probably like a really good item too. I don't feel like going all the way back to, I can't even go back because I don't have strength or rock smash yet, so. I mean, I could go back, but oh, uh, screw you. Meganium, you look too big for this game. Meganium looks way too big. Like that model just needs to be shrunken down just a few pegs, just a few. Like that is so dang big. Like I understand that, I understand that Meganium's like a really big Pokemon and all, but my goodness, that is huge. It is so abnormally large. Hi, there's no way. I, I don't know if Hydro Pump has 100% accuracy, so there's no point in even trying to guess if it does or doesn't. Um, gosh, I don't even really know who to go into. I, I guess going to Torkoal. No, no, no. It has a water type move. Never mind. That would be stupid to do. Oh. Um, Gosh, I'm, I, freaking Meganium size is just throwing me off. Pause. It's just so dang huge. Like, why is it this big? Like, compared to our Pokemon, it's just so small. Matter of fact, compared to every other Pokemon, it's just so dang small. What is it trying to do with Conversion 2? Is it... What, what is Conversion... Oh, wait. Conversion 2, I think, when you get hit by a move, it changes the typing. I think... I think that's how Conversion 2 works. So I'm assuming, one big change I'm assuming with Scarlet and Violet is that there won't be gems. Well, no, no, there will be gems, but there's not going to be eight gems. I don't know why I'm thinking that, but there was like three areas that they were keen, that they were like focusing on. So what I'm assuming is that it's going to be three main gems that you have to battle, but you have to go through a bunch of trials first to finally be able to challenge the gym leaders. And it may not even be gym leaders in general, it may just be like some other kind of leaders, kind of like how uh, the Alola region did it. Wow. I never always look cool in these games. These look so sick. Um, that's what I'm assuming? Just because like they, they keyed in on those three areas, I don't remember the exact one, I think it was like a groundish rock area, and a fire area, and maybe a steel area. Now th those could also possibly just be like the other parts of the region that you can go to. Um, but I'm assuming that those are going to be like the three main gems, towers, something like that. Um, I did like that they put um, two different kind of professors now. But they're like, I I'm, I'm assuming it's going to be maybe whatever. I'm assuming there's going to be like more than one professor, which kind of makes sense because like, why was there only just, only just one professor ever that we focused on? It was kind of weird. Um, I think the rival looks okay. They didn't look that bad. Wasn't like, I wasn't like, so impressed. But I was, you know, I was like, I. Right. I'm hoping that they're not like a freaking annoying rival though. Like, just be cool. Like, can we just get back to like the cool rival that's not so friendly? That's not so like just kiss ass. Like, can we get back to those kind? We don't need to keep having like the same just playful rival that's super annoying. That was one of the biggest things I hated about Sword and Shield was Hop was just annoying. The dude was an annoying. Legends Arceus. Why? 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 Now, now Reggie Ice. Okay. 
Legend Arceus, the, the rival was basically just non-existent. I, I forgot the dude existed half the time, to be honest. He doesn't have an ice type move. Oh, freak you. You serious, dude? Um. <sighs> yeah, just swap out. Just swap out. It's not even worth staying in. Please, please don't have a water move. Just please don't have a water move. I thought this was a bad switch. Oh, God. Okay, thank you. <laughs> oh, wait. Sky uppercut. You, Sky uppercut. You don't hurt yourself. Never mind. Boo. Um, I feel like Reggie Ice has a better physical attack than special attack, and you have a water move. Screw you. Screw you, Reggie Ice. Screw you. Wow. Okay. Okay. Um, uh, swapping a Raphael. Uh, great. I knew I was gonna run into one of these stupid freaking trainers. Why are you making noises? Oh, you don't have a mouth. What do you make noises out of? What do all the Reggies make noises out of? Wow, that's a really high special defense. And Cheater Dance, I'm guessing, with 100% accuracy. Screw you, Cheater Dance. Screw you. I never liked the Reggies. I think I've said this before, but I never cared for them at all. I thought they were just kind of eh. At best, they were like, I. it was there. Really? Why don't you just use Sky Uppercut? I mean, it's gonna be a lot more effective. I don't know why it doesn't. But yeah, the rival. Um, oh, yeah, that's what I was gonna say. Um, rival and Legend Darcy is non existent. Hop, boring. How was pretty cool. See, I liked how. If Hop was more like how, or one, he was actually a threat, um, and two, he was just a bit more entertaining. Like, cause like he wasn't like the most annoying, but he also wasn't like the coolest. He was just cool. He died. But, like if he could be more if, like like if like our new rival could be more like how I wouldn't um um what's I saying? What the fuck I'm saying now? Keep blinking. Um oh how? Goodness gracious, my mind is just boggling right now. It's like twelve thirty. Um if we can get a rival more like how that'd be cool because I don't think we'll get another Gary kind of rival or blue, whatever you want to call him. Uh, we're we'll definitely, we're probably not gonna get another kind of um, silver rival. May was I? I mean, they, they were kind of like just there. They didn't really like bring much to the story. Um, Barry was a pretty cool rival. I wouldn't mind getting another rival like Barry. Oh, Kim, you are getting annoying now, Kim. This is two episodes in a row. Go get a life, Kim. Go get a life and stop bothering me. Um, Barry was actually a pretty cool rival, and I would love to get another rival like Barry. It was fun. And, like, he added a lot to the story. That was the coolest part about him. I think ever since, um, and, oh, and then Cherry and them. You know what? I wouldn't mind another Cherry-style rival. Maybe not so many rival battles. Because, my goodness, there's, like, 30 rival battles between Charon and Bianca. Like, total. Maybe not that many. But I definitely wouldn't mind getting more, um, of, like, the double rivals and getting to... Um, have them be a part of the main story, like a lot of, like a heavily involved in the main story. I would definitely like that. We need another one of those kind that are, granted, they, they have been heavily involved, like Hal and Hop were heavily involved. It's just, Hop was annoying. Like I said, Hop's probably the, the worst one. The Gen 6 rivals were literally, the Gen 6 rival was really annoying. Um, you know, let's put Torkoal up front. I gotta get something for that freaking Suicune. Um, didn't they have like a water move? I wonder what they did that Suicune have that was really annoying. If I remember what it had, then I could... Oh, gosh. We'll probably have to battle Watson either next episode. We'll try it again at the... Wow, this is gonna take a long time. I was gonna say at the end of this, before the end of this episode, but this... If this doesn't take me like three minutes, then I will go ahead and... Well, never mind. Oh, yep. <laughs> Fuck you, Spiel. Fuck you. Oh. Gonna be asleep the entire time. Oh, great. We're gonna be asleep the entire time. This is just fan. Uh, oh, come on, dude. Okay, never mind. You're just weak. Never mind. Okay, not, not, not even a problem. Torkoal, wake up! 
It is literally Torkoal. You are being hit by this Pokemon. How the hell are you not waking up? Oh, come on. <laughs> Dude, for real? Torkoal, wake up. Finally. Oh my god. Dude, you were getting hit by Fairy Attack and Lick. It was licking you when you weren't waking up. Somebody licks me in my sleep. I'm definitely waking up. Like, what the heck, you weirdo? Why are you licking me in my sleep? Okay, thankfully, you have two water types. You better not have a, another freaking stupid, lovely kiss. Oh, come on. Twerkle. Twerkle. Oh, my. Oh, never mind. It's a grass type. Never mind. I don't know why I was thinking. Magical Leaf should have been like a psychic type move. Magical. It's like magical, you know? It's been a psychic. I never understood why it wasn't. We have gotten plenty of types changes for moves. Why don't we get type changes for, for Magical Leaf? Hello, water type? Okay, it's a ground type. Reggie Rock. What does that one look like? Oh, it's one we just bat- Oh, I'm thinking of Reggie Steel. Never mind. I was, I was like, wait, is Reggie Rock the round one? Oh, King Twarkle, dude! You're annoying! You just hit! You just fucking hit! Please! My goodness! Oh, man, this battle would have been a lot quicker, but never mind. Ow! Wasn't point. Okay, well, I'll just heal out the battle, it's fine. We get a new move. Probably like a... No, no, no. Okay! Um, yes, gonna swap on out. Dude, has a, this person has a... Re oh, wait. This dude? Oh, this girl. This girl has a Reggie Rock and a freaking Moltres. You've just been on a journey, haven't you? Been on a crazy little journey there. Should one hit it. Moltres looks really fat around the stomach area. And I don't know why. Okay, Dutini's not bad. Um, Not affected by electric typing, so let's just go into Beautifly. Let's go into Beautifly. Alright, come on, Beautifly. Beautifly, we need a one hit, okay? Just a one hit with the sludge No, you know what? Dread Outrage. We're effective. Let's go. Look at that, me. Look at that, me being big brain. Me being big brain. I have a dragon. Okay, I see you, Drew. Aw, oh, man. I never used freaking Outrage. I could have just took it out with a, a Thundershock. It should actually do a lot of damage. Oh, no, never mind. Only... Oh, never mind. <laughs> never mind. Hey, it worked. Only uh, King Drew has a dragon type and not see Drew. I keep forgetting that. Okay, I'm going to use a Cherry Berry. Not Cherry Berry. Uh, Pekka Berry on... The heck is the name of it? Sparkle, because I don't want to be dealing with this stupid freaking poison affecting the, affecting the entire screen. Um, should we take a shot at... You know what? End of the episode, let's take one shot at him. Maybe we could possibly beat him. If not beat him, we can at least find out the whole team. Venusaur is going to be a pain to deal with. But what I'm thinking is possibly swap in if we need to. Um, I very much could beat it if I like started spamming items, but I don't. I, I, I don't want to do that yet. I would rather because I don't want to spam it because one, we may need to actually grind in a little bit for like the next gym, and two, it's gonna take like ten minutes just doing that. I don't feel like doing all that. That that's really freaking annoying. Uh, do that. Go down here. And if I need to, I could also battle the other trainers in this freaking gym, too. Alright, Watson. That's even your real name. I challenge you to a battle. A battle between gym leader and trainer. And I love the Pokemon uh, gym leader themes in this game. Would like to? Would like to battle. Technically, we won the battle, but I mean, whatever. <sighs> Can we get past the Suicune? Can we get past the Suicune? Okay, on the Leaf Blade. Ooh, this is gonna be annoying. Yeah. Oh. Yep. That's gonna be annoying. Oh, God, that didn't do anything to it. Alright, Horn Attack. Yeah, now we're gonna do Horn Attack. I, I have literally zero way of actually dealing with this stupid sweep tune now. That's just fantastic, though, that it has freaking amnesia. Oh, great. What does Smelling Salt do? What does that do? 
Ward's gonna heal. Oh, no, 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 you gotta hit! What does that move even do? It might wake you up. Oh, gosh! Okay. Come on, get a crit. Get a crit. Get a crit. Get a crit. Alright. Um. He's gonna heal. Yeah. Damn it. Alright, this episode might go a little bit longer, but maybe we could possibly beat him, though. We are doing okay so far. That amnesia is gonna get really freaking annoying, and these smelling salts are gonna get even more annoying. It's making me smell salt. I don't wanna smell salt, dude. We have no healing items, so we can't even heal up Torkoal, even if I wanted to, huh? Another freaking train. Oh, but we do have Moomoo Milk. Oh, uh, yeah, let's go with the Moomoo. -moo. We'll, we'll, we'll use one healing item, it's fine. I'm not gonna, like... I mean, obviously, I can't go crazy with the healing items anyways. Um... Even if he does heal right here, he'll be out of healing items, which is really good. Okay, good. We'll take out Suicune. We will take out Suicune with this hit. Hopefully. As long as we hit. Okay, good. Okay, we hit. What's next? I'm not looking forward to what's next. Horsey. Okay, that ain't bad. That, that, that's not bad. Alright, the team is not that bad. The Horsey. Suicune. Arrgh, you have Dragon Breath. That's annoying. Don't paralyze. Okay, good. I don't, know if it, I don't even know if it paralyzes in this game or not. I think that might have been later games where the, that effect was added. Okay, took out the horse, he took out the sweet coon, he has two water types, a grass type, and what is your other one? Huh. You didn't even touch it! Leaf Blade doesn't touch! Wait, what? Leaf Blade doesn't even actually hit the Pokemon with a... Oh my god, bro. Leaf Blade does not hit physically. Why did we... Leaf Blade's a special type move! Why did that result in static? It's stupid! Oh, that is so stupid! Oh, that, oh, come on! You're, are you serious? Leaf Blade results in a physical... It, 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 I get I get paralyzed from that because of static? Leaf Blade! Special type move! Uh, might as well just stay in at this point. Yeah, might as well just stay in. I'm gonna hit it with a horn attack. Okay, so Venusaur... Oh, yeah. You know what? Venusaur was the ace. I'm stupid. I don't know why I thought it wasn't the ace. <sighs> oh! Fuck. Alright, that that's annoying. That's annoying. We Yeah, let's go to Beautifly. What was the other moves? Pursuit and Leaf Blade is all we do know. Freak. Um uh, hopefully this hits. Gosh, that did so much damage. Oh yeah, it does poison type, you can't poison it. Damn. Much accuracy on that freaking leaf blade. Okay, well, I guess we'll just send in uh, Gloom next. And then finish with. Nah, actually, we'll go with Raphael because Gloom is the grass type. So, yeah, might as well go Raphael. Um, let's see, let's see. What does. Can any of these possibly paralyze? Uh, oh, may paralyze the foe. Okay, we'll go with Thundershock, even though it is a grass type. If we can paralyze it, that'll actually be really freaking helpful. That might crit, though. That crits, we're screwed. Free! It didn't even need the crit. Okay. I have two choices here. I can go with Dragon Dance and hopefully... I'm gonna freaking disable that damn pursuit. I know that for a fact. I'm gonna try to at least. But it only has like. I'm only using pursuit and leaf blade. What else could it possibly know? That's gonna. Oh, that did so much. That did so much. That did so much. That did so much. Damn it. Now fucking cut. Oh, crap. Fucking color change. Use milk drink. Yep, let's go with milk drink. At least now we'll get hit by Leaf Blade and it won't... I mean, like, we won't faint from it. Freaking color change, man! Oh my god! Okay, a couple more levels is what we need. Alright. Alright, well... I definitely hope y'all did enjoy this episode. As always, if you did, make sure you drop a like, subscribe, hit notification bells for more. Links to everything will be in the description below. Twitter, or not Twitter, Twitch, Instagram, TikTok, Discord, YouTube, playlist, thing of a jiggy, all that good stuff. I hope y'all are enjoying the, the YouTube short series with all my opinions on Pokemon. I'm gonna be doing that throughout. I have like every Pokemon, so yeah. I'm, I'm gonna do it for every single Pokemon, so yeah. I'm gonna also be doing some other uh, non-gaming, non-let's-play stuff soon, so stay tuned for that. 
But as but as always, definitely hope y'all did enjoy this episode. And peace out, y'all. Have a great day, everybody. Be safe.